I'm reasonably sure this is our out of here turn. You leave the Esker Trail and follow a fire road. And this does sort of have the wider appearance of a fire road. Who knows? I think it's, yeah, I guess this is pretty much it. It's actually an interesting bushcraft challenge rather than looking for easy to spot blazes you look for little remnant nails and plastic fragments on trees Yeah, this looks about as fire roadish as anything gets around here. Oh, uh, a telltale sign. <laughs> yep, I think I had it figured out. Maybe. This is the Esker Trail. No sign of a little white blaze. We came all the way from the north here. And now we're heading out of here. Yes, I figured it out. Took a little bit. This comes from the north. And here we join the Esker Trail, but significant blazing vandalism at a hilariously confusing <coughs> jumble of trail roads. So when you see that little Esker Trail sign, after all the other confusing nonsense, you come over here and you're in for a bit of a drop. Ta-da! Then you go back up the other side and somewhere around there we find the way to out of here. So this is interesting. There's some element that doesn't really keep this in repair, having poured over the description repeatedly, the trail description, I would say it's way too terse. They just can't find a way to make 
these descriptions engaging. No one bothered to make videotapes. So you end up with this vague nonsense in many situations. and showing little evidence of actually thinking it through for the throngs of the hapless who have to make sense of their gibberish. So yeah, yeah come up that thing and there is a little place just one wouldn't want to have too many it converges with this trail which I had also come down and now we head this way and I imagine it won't be too long before I will have unraveled the Bay Circuit mysteries of Walden Pond. As it is, I may have missed some shore trail sections a bit, <coughs> but much of it's fuzzy and contradictory. And my hiking buddy down on the South Shore noted the same thing. He said in his funny limey accent, you'd think these people never walk these trails, so look at the descriptions they're writing. At that point, I thought it might be a bit of an exaggeration, but at this point, one can only commend the limey for his perspicacity.